Welcome to Survivalist, this is Drasnar. We're playing a little bit of Seven Days to Die. Thought I'd do a quick tutorial on rotation. Rotation by default is set to simple rotation. That means it does the spin around on a plane. Actually, I think I did that one. Here, simple rotation. So you press R to change it to different rotations. You can do it on the face, which is like simple rotation, but basically on them where you have it. So if it's on the wall here, you know, like this. Now it gets a little confused when there's two facings. So it depends on where you're, which you're, where you're pointing. So like if I'm pointing there, you can go off the top, do it there, it's there. So on the face is probably your best option for most of the time because it changes to what you're ever touching. Advanced rotation is going to be the old rotation where we like. So let's get a weird position. There. Now let's say I just picked up an item and I want to copy that rotation. It's going to remember my last one, but let's rotate this a little bit. I'm like, I don't want to go all the way around to get to that rotation. Well, I can click R here by pointing at that object. I can copy rotation and it will default to what that, what, hold on. R, copy rotation, and bam, there we go. So now we're stuck on the same rotation. So that's bit in a nutshell. R, holding it down, gets you down to simple rotation, advanced rotation, on the face, auto rotate. Auto rotate pretty much almost always does it what it thinks best, which is usually tasting to you. And copy rotation will copy the block below, in this case, the concrete. So let's do R here. Copy rotation, and there we got it. And we got our thing sideways for some reason. All right, if you guys like this little demo how-to video, please mash that like button, please subscribe, and in the comments, if you have any other videos you'd like me to try and make on how to do some things, little quick tutorials, please let me know.